You are all welcome to Simplified Maths. I remain your tutor, Bayo Halabi. Today, I will start a series on plane shapes. And this is a teaching I'll be giving you in the next couple of days. But today, I'm going to start with the introduction. Plane shapes. What are plane shapes? Um, plane shapes are shapes that are that can be viewed from one side only. We can call them one-dimensional shape. They only have one side and can be viewed from one side. If you check around you in your sitting room, in your bedroom, there are objects or things that are only one-sided. You can only view them from one side. Any object around you, you can view from one side is a plane shape. Okay. Now I have some examples drawn and written down here. There are so many of them, but because of the space I have here, I cannot draw more than six of them. Okay. I'm going to start with triangle. Okay. This is a triangle. A triangle is a plane shape figure. And we have different types of triangle. We have right angle triangle, isosceles triangle, obtuse triangle, and so on, and acute angled triangle, and so on and so forth. So this is a triangle. A triangle is an object with three sides and three angles. Okay. All right. So a triangle is a plane shape. Then next we have a rectangle. A rectangle is a shape with four sides it has two sides two equal sides that are parallel okay you can see these two sides are parallel okay and they are equal and these two opposite sides are parallel and equal so opposite sides are parallel and equal in a rectangle if you check around you you will see objects that are rectangular in shape just like we have objects that are triangular in shapes. Okay. The next one is a square. A square is a shape with four equal sides. A shape with four equal sides indicated by these lines. Each, sides, uh, each side of a square is uh, equal to the other. If you check around you, you will see objects that are that have a this square shape we have here okay so that is a square a square is a plane shape the next we have here is a circle a circle is also a plane shape okay it's round and you cannot determine its beginning or the end okay so this is a circle then the next one we have here is parallelogram a parallelogram looks like a rectangle can you see they look alike but a parallelogram is a bending rectangle a rectangle that is bending so you can see they look similar but the difference is that this is standing upright but this is bending so a parallelogram is a bending rectangle the two opposite sides are parallel and equal just like we have it in a rectangle so this is a parallelogram then the next one here we have a trapezium a trapezium looks like the shape of a car or a vehicle <laughs> we have different drawings of a trapezium we have another trapezium like this let me just sketch it here i hope you can see it a trapezium also looks like this okay yes uh and another one like this so a trapezium has four sides which none of the sides may not be equal okay none of the sides may not be equal to the other but this is a trapezium and we have some other plane figures other plane shapes like uh kite we have a pentagon hexagon heptagon and so on and so forth we have many plane shapes which i will not be able to introduce you to here but in the course of the lesson i'm going to teach you more about plane shapes so thank you for watching in the next video i'm going to start with the perimeter and area of plane shape we are going to start with the calculation 
of the perimeters and areas of plane shapes and we are going to start with triangle okay i will introduce you to the different types of triangle we have and how to calculate the perimeters and the uh, uh, area of different kinds of triangles we have then i will come to rectangle square circle parallelogram trapezium as much as we can take so thank you for watching if you are watching from facebook kindly hit the like button and also follow the page share this video to people and invite people to this page so that everybody can learn if you are watching from facebook kindly hit the subscription button and also the notification bell so that you get notified for subsequent videos if you are on linked kindly like and also share with your colleagues with your children and we are available for online tutor thank you and god bless see you in the next video bye bye